Hey, this is Blaze. So here we are at the exchange, and I'm getting ready to speak with Warren Calvin. Tell us a little bit about where we're at and what's going on here in this beautiful art room. About the fundraising efforts. Okay. The Wildlife Refuge has been around since 1998, dealing mostly with environmental education and wildlife research in the highland cloud forests of Costa Rica. And what you're looking at is a compilation of artwork that was brought together as a fundraiser for the Cerro Dantas Wildlife Refuge, uh, right now being held at the New Puppy Gallery at 2808 Elm Street in Los Angeles. The painting right there that you see in front of you is David Natal uh, of a two-toed sloth and a tamandua type of anteater. All of the species that you see in these works of art are endangered species of Costa Rica. Uh, the margay, white-faced capuchin, the golden toad, which was one of the first uh, extinct creatures found in Costa Rica. This is by Nicole Bruckman, a well-established artist, now curator as well. This was actually an inspiration from her trip to Costa Rica. We as well have a beautiful work from Jen Lobo, as well another well-established artist. Uh, her work around baby sea turtles and the problems that we have in Costa Rica with a large uh, amount of them actually being taken to eat. What's this? A, uh... That's a giant ant eater by Lefty Joe. <laughs> I love very it. comical, very uh, inspirational artist, very colorful as well. Now, are we still in Costa Rica? Hey! If you get like this, I might take a trip. This is Steven Lopez. Uh, I came across this artist maybe about three, four months ago, fell in love with his artwork and had to bring him into this. We brought these artists together to try to educate a little bit more here in the U.S. Uh, the people about the certain animals that are endangered species and need help. Jaguars are slowly losing a lot of their natural feeding grounds and homes due to development and deforestation. The artists are basically going to donate either 20% of the proceeds on some of their paintings and others they actually donated 100% of the proceeds to the actual cause itself. Give me an example of one 100%. One of the 100% would be this one right over here by Kelly Castillo. What a commitment. The other one would be Kate Daly as well. You know, a lot of these artists did believe in the cause and, you know, in about three months came up with some beautiful pieces for this cause. Adrian Walker as well with the white face capuchin donated 100% of the proceeds to the cause. We have David Natal as well, donated 100% of the proceeds. I love this. Okay, well thank you very much for your name once again. Warren. Hi Warren, and you are from? New Puppy Gallery. Thank you very much. Thank you.